Hi guys, welcome to our third inter-gym competition of the season. This is the course walkthrough for all ages at Conquer Burnsville. There are eight obstacles in the course and there's a three minute time limit. We'll get right into obstacle number one here. The big blue pad I'm on is the start. And then that blue pad over there is the finishing pad. You're allowed to use hands and feet on any side of these three steps as we're moving through. And then the middle can roll in each one. Obstacle number two. For the six to nine year old group, you have the three pillars and then the vault box and then rope and trampoline. For the older two groups, they'll have a trampoline replacing that vault box. And then hands and feet are allowed on any of the pillars, on the vault box, on the trampolines, and on the rope itself. And then the blue pad after that trampoline is your landing. Our next obstacle is just using this big pillar. You can use hands and feet on any side and your starting block is here and your ending is that big blue pad over there. Our next obstacle, the start, is this black pad here. You can use hands and feet on the two uh, soft balance beams. You can use hands and feet on the roller there, but you can only use them on the blue rounded side. And then there's a circle pad at the end. Again, you can use hands and feet on. There's a rope that you can use hands and feet on. The six to nine year olds have another circle pad to shorten that rope swing distance. Uh, so that one will be removed for the two older age groups. Then your landing pad is that long red uh, block there on the side. So again, your landing is right on this one, on our past. Step into our next obstacle. This blue pad is your start. You've got the ring here. This will be raised up for the two older age groups. You've got the blue ring. Again, both of these rings are just hands. And then the big raised blue pad at the end is your landing platform. From here, we'll go to the start of our next obstacle. So this black box here. You're allowed to use hands and feet on the log. You're allowed to grab onto the black straps. The six to nine year olds have the red trapeze bar and ring that they can use their hands on. For the two older age groups, that red trapeze bar will be removed. And then the raised blue pad at the end is your landing. Next up, we have the spider climb. Um, so your starting platform is this wood one here. Um, from there, no hands and feet can touch the red carpet, but you can use any body part on the sidewalls. To clear this obstacle, you'll be picking up that block, and then when that block contacts the big blue pad here, you'll clear this obstacle. Um, so as soon as that block does clear, you're allowed to drop wherever you are and move on to the next obstacle. And 
And then our final obstacle, you can use any structure you want to move your way up the warped walls. To finish the course, you have to get this blue block into the big bucket at the top of the 16 foot wall. You have one opportunity to get two points on this obstacle, and that is tossing this uh, block into the bucket from the 10 foot wall or lower. So you have one opportunity for that, and then after that you can get as close as you want to earn one point and complete the course by putting this into the bucket. I will attempt the two-pointer. It went in. So again, if that missed, I could climb up, set it in, or if it fell off, I'd have to climb back down, grab it, bring it back up, and put it in. So again, there's eight points, a possible of nine if you make that two-pointer here at the end, and a three-minute time limit. Good luck, everyone.